What's going on guys, Stone the Game here with another episode of Chrono Trigger. In the last episode, we arrived in the future. Future... Yeah, the future. And uh, it's not looking great, it's very smoggy. We're actually inside of a place right now and there's still smog, so... <laughs> Everyone's having a bad time. We crossed through one of the labs and made our way to this dome here. And uh, apparently there's a bunch of food downstairs. But no one's ever returned after going down. So, of course, we're going to try our luck and we're going to go down here as well. Let's, uh, let's get feed everybody. Let's, let's save the day. Alright, what do we got? We have... This console controls the passageway. We need a password to get through. This console... Oh, okay, there we go. Alright. And we have all of this going on here some beams I don't really remember all of this it's been such a long time since I played this game but uh we're gonna figure it out I, I really like this parallax map it looks really it looks really good they did a good job on it Can we go this way no Can we go up here we have this stone ugly stone mouse it looks like a statue a memo is attached to it Warning, anyone within the vicinity of the stock room will be attacked. Well, okay, that explains why people haven't been coming back. They've been being brutally murdered by things. And still, more pipes. All right. Okay, and we're instantly in a boss fight. That's fun. Executing program. Chrono, what's going on? We don't know. Marley, let's go. We're immediately in a fight, though. So, you know, obviously we're going to attack these bit guys first because they seem very dangerous. Yes, yeah, that's, serious, that's serious damage compared to what we were taking before. Obviously, we're going to have Marley on healing duty. This is no joke. They came after us so quickly. <laughs> We're going to heal Luca next turn. Let's go. Oh, no. That, that wasn't too bad. Alright, that's gone. Let's get our aura on Luca and... Let's see how much Flame Toss does compared to what we're doing. I think we're doing about like 45. What do we got here? Zero! Ew. Screw that. All out attack. Five. Got a countdown going on. This can't be good. Come on, let's try to get some more. Four. Might have to heal up on Marley just to keep her health. Nice. Okay, that's what I'm talking about. Do it. Let's get him before we even go. Can we get another? Can we get another double attack here? Let's go. There we go. He's nice. <laughs> We're about to get hit with something, though. Oh, come on now. It revives the bits. Okay. Okay. We don't want to get hit by that massive triangle attack. Now, see, I do remember that. I don't remember fighting him, fighting this this soon. I thought this boss was at the end of the food supply area. Um, so I thought we had some time for this boss. But I do remember if we leave the bits alive, they do a very vicious, like, triple attack together. And it's not good. We don't want to get hit by that. Oh no. Yeah, we're gonna run a heal on, on Chrono. Chrono, Chrono, I'm gonna be mixing that up the whole time. Aura on, bam, let's go. That was a good one too. I need you to jump up there again. He's breaking down? I think we did it. 
Nice. That was a little scary. I wasn't ready for that. But we made it through. 300 experience. Found $1,000. Luca leveled up. Awesome. And we just... We grew back together like nothing just happened. And, uh... Yeah, we're actually doing okay. I'm going to throw a tonic on Luca and Marley just to get them back up to speed. But we really didn't have to, you know, strain ourselves that much there. And, yeah. Whew! Something reeks. All this food's rotten. Yeah. Yeah, everything's completely rotten. The refrigeration must have failed. Chrono, look. Passed away long ago, I suppose. He's holding something. What do you suppose this is? It looks like some kind of seed. So of all things, a seed was saved. Do you suppose it could grow in a place like this? They will have to figure it out. It's really the only way. And we have a mid-ether. Poor gentleman. A rat is more than just a statue. It knows the secret of this dome. Catch it. Okay. And we have to catch the mouse now. We have to be basically perfect. I'm not good at this part. And the chase begins. There. There it is. Don't yell. Yeah, exactly. It might run away. Dash to the B button. Catch him with the A button. Okay. Charge. It's so quick. So quick. Yo. Gotcha. Squeak, I give up. I can't believe we got on the first try. I'll tell you everything, Squeak. Press and hold the L and R buttons and press the A button to access the secret passage, Squeak. <laughs> Don't make any mistakes or you'll be sorry. Well, I feel like I might be sorry. That's scary. I don't want to be sorry. It's so, it's so likely, though, that I'm going to be sorry. Like, that's, that's the problem. <laughs> Alright, so... L and R, and then we press A. Alright, we did it. Now, let's... Um, uh, you know what? Let's go through here first. I was thinking that maybe that we'll go back upstairs, but I don't want to trigger, like, a scene of us giving them the seed back before it's necessary. Um, we don't take kindly to rats dancing around machinery, so let's take care of that. Oh, okay. That's awesome. So it attacks literally everything moving, so we're just gonna wait. Oh! Oh! Never mind! He's a beast! It's too strong. It's too strong. <laughs> 54 experience, 45G. Chrono leveled up. Not even fair. All right, and we have a mid ether. This looks like it goes absolutely nowhere. Okay. And we have these, uh, almost said bird, insect guys. Beetles or whatever. This says bug. Oh, they actually have some defense too. They survived. Yeah, when she hits 90, it's absolutely unbelievable because she usually hits like 30, between 35 and 50. But I don't know if that's a crit or what, but it's it's on par with Chrono. Like, it's, it's nuts. 52 experience. We get a heal. Okay. We haven't really been under any status problem, so. Well, whatever. It's good to have. Let's go. Let me get a double. One shot, though. So they probably have about 85 or 90 experience uh, health. Can we get one shot? Nope, 42. Yeah, they have to be at least... Yeah, that's just overkill for no reason. 52 experience, another heal. Let's keep moving. Alright, and what do we have in here? Will we have another... Oh, okay, we have more robots. Let's take them out. This is great sprite work, too. Double attack? No double attack? 14. We can we can take those hits, though. 22 experience, 50G, a tonic. Yeah, we can take those hits, so that's fine. Uh, let's see here. Is this even a circle? It's not a circle. It's not a tumor. It's not. All right. Uh, <laughs> we can go all the way around here. If we want to, this is really far into it. Let's go back and actually... I can never decide which way to go. I usually go the wrong way first, so... Let's turn that around.
All right. So let's see. Are we gonna be let these guys? All right. So let's use our slash and our flame toss on the other. Nice. All right. I was a little worried we might not beat them there. 20 experience, 100 G. No items. That's fine. How are we looking on health and everything? Pretty good. All right, and we have another angry robot. This is gonna be just hitting everything. Yeah. Pretty crazy. Let's get him out of here before he starts. Yeah, he's gonna attack us for, he's, it's an auto counter attack. That actually does good damage, so let's get rid of him as fast as we can. Oh wow, they're kind of eating us right now a little bit. It's the tiny damage that does it, really. I mean, with her, with her aura spell only costing one MP, it's so good. It's too good. It's way too powerful for only costing one. That means we have 30 heals outside of our items. Speaking of which, yeah, it does a. It's doing a hundred right now. It's not even. It's ridiculous. All right, so yeah, we came back around, came back through there actually. Um, no, that's not it. Let's keep going this way. It looks like we're starting to wrap around too, so that's even better. Kill me one shot. Oh, we get hit first. Nice. Oh, I thought he was gonna come in with the second, but he didn't. That should do it. Let's move on. 22 experience, 50 G, and a tonic. Nice. Luca levels up. Getting stronger. Okay. And we have a secret door here. Oh, we're actually cut off from it as well, so we can't even go down. We'll have to go back around. What about up here? Just to see. Okay. Looks like that's where we want to head after we defeat everybody else. Let's take care of these guys. I believe there's only two robots in here, and then we can move on. I feel, I feel like I have a sneeze coming. Can we finish it? One after this. Eleven. There we go. That's what I want to see. Nice. And we have this guy. Nice. Okay. 22 experience, 50 G, and a tonic. Awesome. And nothing here. So let's run back around and go inside this last room and see what we have. So this is the info center. Good, the computer's still operational. If we run a search of time warps, we might find our gate. Here, got it. East of Eris Dome. So we have to go through that lab that we looked at. And there is another, okay. Yeah, there's, there'll be another dome and that's where we'll get our ticket somewhere else. That would be Protodome, I believe. Leave it to Luca. I'm beginning to think you could find anything with this device. Say, what does this button do? Oh no. 1999 AD, visual record of the day of Lavos. All right, we're gonna see what happens. Cause we are, we are in 1000 AD. So basically, uh, Y2K happens <laughs> it's no good oh no that's bad news bears talk about AOE the end of the world
What? What is that? Lavos? Is that what's destroying our world? We must truly be in the future. No, no way! I refuse to believe it! This... This can't be the way the world ends. Well, people have both survived, so it's not over until it's over. Chrono! There's only one thing we can do. We must change history. Just like Chrono did when he saved me. Okay, Luca? Okay, Chrono? And we were given, like, a divine mention by this mission by this princess chick. Out of nowhere. I, I guess so. Yeah, I'm on, I'm on the fence with you as well. It was a stroke of luck that we were sent here through that gate. Chrono, let's go. Okay. Yeah. Chrono, Luca, together we can do this. Let's take a second and do some more research on Labos activities back in our time period. Next stop, the Protodome. Okay, so we have all the information we need and we can go back now. It looks like all the enemies have come back as well. Well, we'll we can fight this one. They pose no real threat to us. We've proven that, so... We can cut through the ones we have to, but let's go back. Oh my god, the, the soundtrack though. Every time. I want to bump it up, but I don't want it to spill into the speakers. I want to hear it. Stupid rats. Alright. Yeah, um, we're actually going to pause until he takes care of all of them. Actually, if I don't have to move, like, if I can just attack this one. Okay, never mind. So it moved. Nope. Not how it works. I was wrong. <laughs> dun, 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 dun. But we're just, we're firing a gun. How exactly are we moving? But whatever. That's cool. 92! Yo, she's vicious with that. I, I just don't get it. Uh, overkill on the rat, man. But, well done. 72 experience. Why so much? 45G. Honestly, with that, we're gonna clear, we're gonna clear again. Why not? I mean, you know, so much experience that we just... I don't even know how we can get over there, but I want to now. It's way too much experience. We gotta, gotta keep the experience. Why not? Doesn't hurt. We are gonna heal Marley. I mean, we are gonna heal Luca with Marley. If we have time. Nice. Alright. We are going to heal. Yeah, we're going to heal Marley as well. Might as well. Bump her up. Mm, oh. No time for the heal, whatever. All good. We got the power. Alright. What's up? You got some work for me? That's good. Oh, I was like, give me the one shot. Ninety-six. Nice. Twenty-two experience, fifty G, and a tonic. The usual. We're good to go. Oh, we have to get through here. Show me what you got, you beetles. Not afraid of you guys. Oh no. Oh, miss. Good good dodge. Awesome. Try to run it back. They don't have what it takes. We're going to move that up to the top. I actually feel like I prefer it. I don't know. It, it moves by itself sometimes, and I kind of just like let it... I let it go where it wants. Try not to really think about it. Like, it started on top, but it might move to the bottom if we, you know, if we end up more at the top of the screen. It's weird how it does that, but it's cool. I like it. 
I know one thing, the soundtrack though, it bangs, it bangs. 92 though, it's, un it's crazy when she hits that high. Luca hasn't done anything like that yet, I wonder what the difference is. I know um, her attack is doubled, but I mean, I don't believe it has any types of secondary abilities on it or whatever. It was just too early of a game for all that. Let's do this though. Okay, and it can shoot in a line too, which is pretty nuts. Take this thing out, let's do it. 88 on the rat, which is still crazy every time I see it. Bum, bum, bum. We're full of purpose right now. Feels good. All right, what's up, guys? You're back. Ooh, ooh, I'm gonna have a sneeze coming. Well, what did you discover? This is our future. Uh, what? Who cares? Where's the food? This is all we could get. Seeds. You don't know how long the inertron, the inertron hold out. Those seeds might be your only hope. You have to stay alive, and so do we. Huh? You're strange. You're different from us. I think it's because we're healthy. Yeah. He healthy? Got a nice ring to it. We'll try growing the seeds. What are those? They just might be our future. Heading for Protodome, go by way of Laboratory 32 and take this with you. A bike key! Awesome! It's a key to the jet bike in Lab 32. I used to ride it when I was young. Hope it still works. They've got more powerful robots over there. Take care and stay healthy. All right. We just like push that guy out of our way. You can reach the continent to the south. Okay, yeah. They all say the same things. Let's uh, go inside the health, the Intertron. Still hungry, yeah, still hungry. And let's save. Hey guys, let's yeah, let's go outside and we'll we'll say we'll we'll call it there. We'll call it there. All right, yeah, it's like a whole deal leaving here. <laughs> All right, yeah, let's run our let's run our safety save out here. Beyond the ruins, we're good. All right, guys, that is the episode. If you did enjoy, leave a like. Also, if you're watching this on Twitch, hit that follow button and then go over to the YouTube page and hit that subscribe button and ring the bell to join the squad so you get notifications for when we drop videos. Right now, we're dropping videos every single day, so make sure you click, click, click that follow button and click, click, click that subscribe button to join the squad. Also, share on all social media platforms, Stone the Gamer, the real Stone the Gamer, get the word out, and comment down below if there's any games you'd like us to play. In the next episode, we are going to head up to the other laboratory, and I believe we're going to get into that that bike race. That'd be really cool. But until then, this is Stone the Gamer signing out. Hope everyone has a great rest of the day, and I'll see you in the next video. Later, guys.